Hey there, Sabrina here. So what you're looking at is my iPhone. So I am going to teach you how to document your journey using your iPhone. If you've never done it before, here is a tutorial for you. So it all starts with your camera. So we're gonna go to my camera and you see the screen now, obviously. We're gonna go to video. You're gonna reverse it. Hey, you're gonna see me here. But here's what I want you to do with the camera. You always wanna go to the side, okay? So we are going to take a video at the side and there's a little hole that I'm pointing at right here, which is where you are going to record video. So we'll do a test, all right? So you're gonna click video. Hey there, Sabrina Walker here. Super excited to share this training with you. This is how you can document your journey and make it happen. Check out more at sabrinawalker.com. You rock. And then we end the video. So what we do from here is we have a video now on the phone. So we are gonna go back, okay? And we are going to go back here. And what we want to do is we want to upload this to YouTube now. We're going to find the video. Okay, so once you get to this screen right here, there's a little, um, these are all your videos and all that good stuff. You're going to hit select in the top right hand corner. And it's going to have you say select items. We're going to select the video we just recorded. Now on the bottom left, you'll see a little box with an arrow up that's to share. You're gonna click that and you are going to see the YouTube icon. You're gonna click YouTube. Now first, let me see this. You have to have a Gmail account already set up. If you do not have one yet, this will not work. So go to gmail.com or google.com, gmail.com, yeah, sure. Um, set up an account um, and if you have one, great. Uh, Cause you're gonna need it. So make sure you set that up first before you uh, continue watching this video. You're gonna give it a title. And this one is, let's see, how to document your journey. We'll just put with video because this is a step-by-step. -step. We can add a description on all that stuff later. Um, it's usually good to put it in now for SEO purposes, but if this is your first video, this is just supposed to be a quick video, um, add a description, you can do all kinds of things. I always do HD. To do HD, you have to be connected to Wi-Fi, your phone, and as you see, uh, mine is. So I wouldn't recommend uploading a video using HD on your data plan. Actually, I don't even think it would work. Um, that would be grayed out if you didn't have uh, Wi-Fi. So always have Wi-Fi. Tags are good. Tags are what um, YouTube uses to kind of distinguish what your video is about. I wanted two things. Okay, so I always do Sabrina Happens. You're seeing all the behind the scenes here. This is about um, document your journey, document your journey. All right, you can put a hundred tags in here. Not really, but I just put a, a bunch. Um, the category I choose is how to and style, usually, because I do how to videos a lot. Public, yes, I want the world to see it. So let me explain these to you real quick. Unlisted means that the public can't see it. The only people that can view the video is if you send them that link. Um, at the top because it's your account when you log in you get a link you can share it with people and send it around But the public world can't see it on your channel private means that you can actually specify um, Through YouTube who you want to see who you want to see it who yeah <laughs> um, But I always do public just because any videos I put up that's fine if people see it if you're like not 100% sure if you want someone to see it then just choose unlisted and only you can see it. So my account right now that it's posting to is Diva Trends and I don't want that account to show up. So I actually have to log into YouTube for the first time. So it's good that this is happening. 
Um, so I want this connected to my Sabrina W978, whoops, at gmail.com. Done. Next. Uh, my password. Okay. So my password's in. We're going to hit sign in. And then it says iOS would like to, you have to hit allow. And then it's going to do its thing. And then, unfortunately, we have to type this in again. Um, how to document your, all right, let's spell it right, journey with video. Okay, I'm just going to put this for now. Learn more at sabrinawalker.com. All right. If you don't have a website right now, that's okay. Stay tuned. I got more videos coming. I will hook you up. Okay. Again, HD tags. Oh, Lordy. They all got thrown away. Sabrina Walker. Um, Sabrina happens. Oh, no. Sorry. Got to decline the husband. I'm in a meeting. <laughs> Sorry, lovey. Okay, uh, let's see here. Sabrina happens, category, how to. All right, it's public. Now that's the right account. So we're going to do this, learn more. We're going to hit publish, um, HD, yep. We're going to hit publish. Now at the bottom, you'll see preparing video. It's going to take a few seconds. So we are going to let it do its thing. Seven seconds left. This is a really short video, so it's not going to take that long. One thing I like to do as it's publishing, publishing complete, bam, video is up. So what I like to do is I like to uh, view on YouTube just to make sure it's there. It's going to load it and it's still processing it, which is okay. So how to document your journey with video. Basically, here is the video. They're processing it. Um... But it's officially up as soon as this is done. So here's another tip too. When you, so this is on your YouTube channel. Um, another thing is for you, Facebook loves Facebook. Facebook does not love YouTube. So if you want to upload this video, um, again, this is just a test video. I'm going to show you how to do this on Facebook too. Um, we'll do Facebook first. This is going to be a really good tutorial for you. So what I like to do, um, this is profile. So you can click on what's on your mind. These are videos I uploaded today. Click on photo. Even though it's a photo, I mean, even though it's a video, it's a photo. <laughs> That's my husband last weekend. That's too funny. So you're going to click on the video. You're going to hit done. And it's going to say new. No, choose whether to upload an HD. Hmm, HD sounds good. So let's see what edit. Hey means. there, Sabrina Walker here. Super excited to HD share off. this training with you. Upload videos this is in how HD. you can document your journey okay. and make it happen. So we just Check did out upload more at sabrinawalker.com on Your HD. Work. Okay, cool. Hey there, Sabrina right. Walker here. Done. Done. So now that's good. We want to upload it in HD because that's a good deal. Um oh, sorry. So say something about this video. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. I can give copy lessons later about what to do and how to say things. Um, but that's how you upload the video and you hit post and bam, it goes to your Facebook. So anytime you cut a video on your phone and you upload a video, upload it to YouTube first. So it's on your YouTube channel and then upload it to Facebook from your phone. Don't like go and get the YouTube link and then put it into Facebook because it does this really weird thing where it makes the video super small. And yeah, that's nice. My hubby's on his way. So make sure you upload the video from your phone to Facebook. And you see how the video is nice and long. It fills up the whole user screen. That's the reason why you have to use your phone the sideways, okay? Number one thing with video. Never shoot a video like this, okay? Don't do it. Don't be one of those people, okay? Um, shoot a video sideways. If I turn my phone, yeah. Shoot a video like this. Oh, this is a good little training right here. Anytime you're shooting a video, right, always shoot it like this and look at the dot. This dot right here is your best friend, 
okay? This is the audience. This is who you're talking to right here. Hey there, Sabrina Walker. I'm not looking at the screen. I am looking at this dot, okay? So video tips here. Uh, what else? Yeah, look at the dot and then keep on working. So here's, here's the phone. Here's what you see on the screen. Um, I'm going to hit cancel. I want to discard it because I don't want to save it. And then it brings me back to Facebook. So um, how do you do that on Instagram? You click on Instagram. And with Instagram, you can only upload 60-minute videos. They don't allow you to upload longer than that unless you're doing stories and stuff like that. But um, I like to use the little plus sign at the bottom. And pick, you can see here on the bottom, mine say 57 seconds, 55 seconds. That 101 that you see there had to be trimmed to the one minute. So 57, 55, those are good. You cannot do longer than 60 minute videos. So if you click there, right, don't select multiple because it will go in the same thing. Um, you'll hit next and then you'll hit next again. You can do filters and all that stuff. Don't worry about the filters. And then you just write a caption, blah, 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 blah. Okay, and then you hit okay. I'm not gonna do it now because I already posted this video. Okay, so that's how you document your journey. That's how you upload video to YouTube, to Instagram, um, to Facebook. That's gotta be a good tutorial to start with. So I just want to inspire you to document your journey and to share your world with other people and help them. So what I always like to say, love deeply, serve others, and lead faithfully. You can do it.